What is up? My station is a mess. All right, so my hair is filthy. I washed it. Friday. So, <laughs> and I went boxing four times since Friday, so. It is dirty, dirty, dirty. So, what am I gonna do? Definitely not wash it, that's crazy. Let's not be crazy. I'm gonna use my Aveda shampoo, dry shampoo. Hi, Danielle. All right, so I'm just going to, it comes out like a puff, ready? Poofy, poofy, woohoo. So I'm gonna puff that all throughout my roots. I'm not gonna worry about it getting white because when I rub it all in, that will go away. And I'm gonna focus on both the roots and a little bit down your hair shaft because it is filthy. I'm not a fan of washing my hair. I don't know if anybody didn't know that about me, but if you didn't know, now you know. I feel like I should just open the bottle and just like pour it on my head. So for those people who are like, I have to wash it every day, uh, no you don't. Stop being crazy. So now that I got that all up in there, I'm just gonna take my hands and just rub my fingers through it just so that it gets everywhere it needs to go. Look at that, no grease. See, I have volume again. What now, baby? I wish I could just leave it like this, but <sighs> due to my profession, I can't. All right, so I'm gonna hit them old school with the flat iron curls, because I haven't done that in a while. And mostly because my curl iron's downstairs. Hi, Karen, and I'm not going downstairs to get it. All right, so flat iron, how do we do it? We put the flat iron in your hair, and you rotate it as you go up. Open and closing, and there you go. You got a flat iron curl. Same. So now that my hair is getting like long enough, I can kind of just bring it all forward so that I can almost get all of it. Hi, Jessica. Are you still cleansing, Jessica? I'm on day two. Sucks. Hi, Ashley. All right, so thankfully I don't have this piece. It's a little less work, you know? I'm all for less work. I didn't spray anything in my hair because I have enough heat protectant in there for like the last five days that I don't think I need any extra. I probably should, but Oh, you did, I know, I'm still on day two, so. And I worked out both days, like I went boxing, which like, they're kinda like, you shouldn't do high intensity working out. I'm like, well, yeah, I know, but if I don't, I don't just, I like boxing, so I went, and I'm fine. I did try those, Um, it should've come in your kit, like the little hydrate packages that you put in water, those are actually really yummy. So that helped me. And I'm drinking my Isogenics coffee today, which is like, okay. I like my coffee really dark. And it's not so dark, which is good because then I don't have to put a lot of stuff in it. But I'm down 22 pounds, everyone. Holla for Odala. And my husband, I took his picture today while he was on the phone because he's like, I don't see a difference about himself. I'm like, yeah, okay. My sister like walked by him at the supermarket because she didn't know it was him. Guess how many times a week he goes boxing. Thanks, Danielle. Like you bastard. But I am now below the weight I was for my wedding. So 
My goal is to try on my wedding dress and it'd be huge because I'm pretty much two pounds away from the lightest I've ever been since like, I don't know, the eighth grade. So I'm not really sure what I look like or what happens next. So I don't really have a goal in mind. I know that there'll be a point where I look too skinny, which I don't want. But all for my Cygenics, man. And obviously now the boxing is kicking it up into overdrive. But I've never felt better, which is awesome. And I love when it's, you know, it's $300 a month for your program and people are like, that's so expensive. It's like, oh my God, it's so much cheaper than going to the oven. And the amount of food I used to throw away. You go in the supermarket, you're like, oh, I'm gonna eat strawberries, grapes, pineapples, apples, oranges, and then you get home and it's like, no, I'm not. And by the time the end of the week comes, you throw it all out, it sucks. So the shakes work for me. I know haters are gonna hate, but they work for me better than anything I've ever done before. So I'm just curling my hair. And I had a great uh, allergic reaction to a new face wash I tried this weekend. <laughs> that was fun. So thank God I wasn't doing makeup this weekend because I was scary looking. I think I got the back. My eyes are still recovering. You can see like they're super red. And I even one underneath. My eczema came out in full force. I think it's eczema. I don't even know anymore. I'm just rambling, you know what I mean? It's all my energy for my isogenics. <laughs> Hi, Crystal. And then, of course, I went yesterday to, because I ordered my makeup unit so that I could display the makeup at work. And I called Home Depot to see if it had come in. And they're like, no. And I was like, what do you mean, no? They're like, no. Do you have an order number? I was like, no, I can't find one. I never ordered it. So. That's going to hold up my makeup for a couple of more days. I'm like, what the f***? Only me. And even Ryan, like, remembers me doing it, but wasn't on my credit card bill. Hi, Michaela. We missed you, girlfriend. <laughs> Crystal, you're so cute. So, like I said, I haven't washed my hair in five days. Come smell it. Thanks, girl. I don't want to call you Rubia. I want to call you Susanna. Because <laughs> I know you from way back when. Yeah, my hair color is awesome, which is why I don't want to wash it. I don't want it to fade. It's like perfect right now. It's like the perfect mermaid, you know what I mean? And that is what I'm aspiring to be. I'm not gonna lie, I just got a whiff of dirty hair. <laughs> I know, I'm thinking of doing that very soon, D. I just called the company and I asked them if I could use their photos from the website, and they're like, no. I'm like, no, cool. So I have to photograph all my own stuff, which will be fine. I need a little extra love right there. This is dirty and stinky. I try and go a week. I know it's gross, but I love when people are like, I love your hair color. I'm like, yeah, I wash it. Once. How do you keep it like that? I'm like, uh, I wash it like at most once a week, maybe every 10 days. They're like, I'm like, wow. Sacrifice. I can still wash my body. Washing my hair is like a chore. I have to scrape my scalp. I have to exfoliate my scalp. And I have to do a shampoo, and then I have to do a mask, and then I have this gross, weird placenta spray that I spray in it. Yeah, that happened. I saw something online that was like, this girl's hair was junk, and she used some spray that had animal placenta in it. So I was like, ooh, okay. The bottle will last me for getting a year, considering how infrequently I wash my hair. All right, last section, I think. And I'm not even sweating, that's how you know it's cold out. Usually by now I'm like sweating like a pig. 
Probably have no sweat left from Box. I go to Box and at Tidal in Saugus and sometimes the one in Danvers. And I swear to God, I'll be like, oh my God, that's the craziest trainer I've ever had. And then like five classes later, I'll have a new guy and be like, what the f No mercy. Hmm. I haven't done the flat iron curls in a while. Kind of digging them. Maybe I'll wash my hair eventually. Just kidding. All right. So I'm just putting my hair in and like rolling it. And the flat iron curls, my friends, practice makes perfect. They're not easy. It's hard at first. You'll get a bunch of dents. But the more you practice, the better you'll get at it. And I have no hairspray in my house. FYI, hairdresser with no hairspray. Not only am I a hairdresser, I own a hair salon. Like, what's wrong with me? I only have one hairspray and I don't like it, so I'm not using it. Alright, for reals. So, I think I got all the back. Guess what? It's as good as it's gonna get. Hi, Michelle. Oh, I can see all like my little breakage pieces that fell off. All right, so let's start. <laughs> Thanks, Dottie. Uh, my favorite is definitely the Aveda dry shampoo. When I my hair was short, I really liked the Aquage one, but with longer hair, the Aveda one's my favorite. All right, so I'm gonna start with my botanical kinetics and spray my face. And like I said, I had a wicked allergic reaction this weekend to some face wash. So that's why I'm so red. My skin is so freaking sensitive. So for anyone who is sensitive and, you know, they're always like, if I can wear it on my face, you can wear it on your face. My face is so freaking sensitive. Okay. Birthday soup. This is my concealer slash eyeshadow primer in one. So I'm going to use it on my eyelids as an eyeshadow primer. You can see like the dry me. It's nothing compared to what it was like yesterday though. I like lathered up in hydrocortisone. Okay, so that's on. And then the colors I'm gonna use today, one is like my fave, it's called Maybe Baby. So this is my Maybe Baby. And then I'm gonna use this color, which is Rosy Tan. All right, so I'm gonna start with my Maybe Baby. Hi, mother. The pigment on this one is like, my sign guy's calling me, he nobody got time for that, and now my thing's on low battery, Jesus almighty. <laughs> so I'm going to take that same color and run it underneath my lash line. And this is my brush, the small cream brush. And I'm also going to run that underneath my lash line.
What's the greatest thing about my makeup line? It doesn't get on your face. It doesn't, there's not a ton of overfall. So I'm gonna go on with the color Rosy Tan. And just bring that on the inside corner of my eye. And on the inside on the underneath. <laughs> yeah, me too. It's so pretty. Maybe baby. I did realize I didn't have a green in my kit, so I have to order their evergreen. Because I'm a big fan of green. Alright, so then I'm going to clean off my brush using my Sephora color switch. Clean, and then I'm going to blend. My poor eyelids are so dry. I'm just kind of wiping it on the Sephora color switch as I go. And my eye lids are so dry. Oh, there's my husband. Hi, Ryan. are all dry because it's so hard to blend. So then I'm going to use for my eyebrow highlight this color Sandy Peach. And I'm going to need some concealer because my face is here. So I'm going to go back in with my birthday suit. I should have put on my modest hat first now that I'm thinking. Alright, I wiped guys. Let's throw my modest hat. What did she say? Modest hat. Where you at? Chafing relief gel. So I'm just gonna throw that all over. I'm not even gonna put it where I just put the concealer. It works just as good as eyeshadow, I mean, as photo finish from Smashbox. It has the same exact ingredients, but it is a third of the price. I'm game for that. And my phone is going to die. I'm going to grab a charger. Be right back. 
Alright, sorry guys, I'm back, I'm back. I just want to charge, put my phone on the charger before it dies in the middle of the video. Okay, so, I'm on a step. Now I'm going to go back in with my concealer. Conceal my spots that need to be concealed. my birthmark. Oops. My pimple. Thanks, Rachel. Okay. So now that I look like a scary light mess. So now this is my CC cream, which I love. All right, so the deal with this stuff, it goes on white, and then as you blend it, it conforms to your skin color. So white, white, white. So then as you blend it, it brightens up your skin and conforms to your skin color. So this is the color medium. And I'm using my Sculpt Foundation brush. See it changing? How cool is that? Might be the coolest thing ever. What the hell they're doing outside? They drive me nuts. All right. So then I'm going to go in with my powder. So this is my Soft Focus Powder in the color Bear. I'm just going to put that on my powder brush. My brush is shining. Grab another brush. Nobody gets half of that right now. So I'm more of a BB or CC cream person and then a powder foundation over it. I'm not into the really matte full coverage foundations. I like to be able to see some imperfections. So I'm going to go in with a, this is my large cream brush. Just bring it up closer to my eye. You didn't want to join me, a jerk? Huh? I know you're there. I can hear you breathing. Did you get my invite? I tried to invite you to come on camera. 
whatever. This is my blush in bouquet. Super pigmented, so you only need a little. <laughs> As I say that, nothing comes out. Allow. I feel like I wet it before by accident. Here we go. All right. Then I'm going to go in with my NYC brand liquid eyeliner. Where are you going? Oh, okay. Extend the wing out a little bit. And I'm sorry if I make it look easy, but I've been using the same exact eyeliner brand since I was 16. I'm 32. It's a lot of years of practice. I'm just going to blend this a little more. All right. Until it got dry, I feel like it's heavy. Heavy on my eyeballs. No. All right, so I'm still have not found my freaking eye pencil, my liner, I mean my brow pencil. So I'm just gonna use straight up my eyeshadow in black with my shadow liner brush. And just lightly draw in I am blessed in the eyebrow department, so I don't need too much work on my eyebrows. And I have a great brow girl, Samantha Valerie, from Hair by Christina Go. Come see her to get your brows done. So then I'm gonna, I know I had the, the brush tip thing. Oh, I, fi I just found it, you bastard. Finally. I've been trying to find this stupid thing forever. Guess where it was? Right in front of my face. Alright. Well, at least we know the black eyeshadow works the same way. So I'm just going to brush them. Okay. And then, mascara. If I can find it. Unique mood struck epic. That's great. Hi, Bonnie. I need a lash lift, like, whoa.
Ash is good. I just realized I didn't brush my teeth. So I'm going to have to put my lipstick on for you guys. Take it off to brush my teeth. But the things I do because I love you guys. All right, so this is my liner. This is a waterproof gel liner. This is in the color Sweetie Pie. It's not an exact match, but this is the color of the day. It's called You Wish. Girl, you wish. It's nice and bright. Oh yeah. Love it. Oh, the lip liner is actually almost an exact match. So this is the look of the day for today. Let me just brush through these curls. So my eyeshadow is Maybe Baby in Rosy Tan. The lips are in You Wish. I used my CC cream and my powder finish foundation over it. I used my birthday suit concealer and eyeshadow primer in one. And this is it. And my blush bouquet. So I hope everyone likes it. And I will check you guys tomorrow. Have a wonderful day. Bye.